Welcome back to Star Ocean 3. Last time, um, we hacked our way into the Eternal Sphere, and we can now travel pretty much to any of the planets that we have been to previously. Um, this is Vanguard or something? Van... I don't remember what it was called already. I took a little break. This planet is not important at all. There's a few treasures scattered around that I'm not going to bother to get right now. I may get them later off screen for the bonus dungeons uh, in the end of the game before I take you guys through those. For now though, I want to head back to Elacor. I will probably be doing some crafting in this episode, I'm hoping. In fact, there's probably going to be a lot of running around in this episode. Okay. Maybe there's going to be an event instead. It's better not advance the plot, because I am not ready for it. At all. Not even close. God damn it, game. Couldn't you just beam us all back at once? All right, then. What's next? That's one of those things where it just extends the game... Just by a few seconds, but over the course of 50 hours, it adds up. I think it would be fastest to go to the Spear Company, the group that developed the Eternal Sphere. I disagree. Sounds good. I do not want to go there yet. The Spear Company is in that place they call the Lost City, right? That's right. Wonderful. Let's go through the station to the Lost City. Everything that matters will happen after we get there. You hear that? That's a clue. Finally, something will matter in this game. Unit data verification, character name, Plump Line God, Registered Galaxy, Milky Way. This character has entered the following six regions. Soul 2, blah blah blah, Soul 3, Soul 3 Satellite, blah blah blah. The following regions are currently down for maintenance. Soul 3 and Haida 4. Or Haida, yeah, 4. Um, this character has administrator privileges and can go to sticks. Okay, just give me the destination that I can go to game. Let's go to... We can go to the moon base. Which... I'm not really interested in Elicor 2, please. Understood. Beginning transport of Plump Line God to Elicor 2. Now, enjoy your adventure. And remember, death is permanent. Okay, so this is where we end up at. The Airy Hills. Surrounded by a bunch of monsters. I am not going to remember how to get back here. <laughs> We're gonna be stuck on this planet again. No! Okay, I think we need to go this way. We're gonna go all the way back to Paterni. Is this treasure chest still there? That yeah, is. Can I get to it? A jewel of refuge. A jewel of wasting my time. I will never use it. Actually, I might use it in um, some of the upcoming areas. I'll. I'll tell you guys some spoilers here. There's a dungeon coming up that is almost 100 floors long. I may or may not showcase that entire dungeon to you guys. I don't know. It's a really long dungeon. Each floor is pretty much random too. There's multiple layouts that each floor can be. I don't know. To tell you the truth, this place hasn't changed that much. They'll have to start improving things around here even if a little at a time. If they ever want to restore areas to how it used to be. Well, give them time. I'm sure most of them are probably still in shock. The war's over and countless lives have been lost. Nothing really seems to matter anymore. What do you say, Maria? It appears that this planet is still safe. But, we must hurry up and do something about the executioners. This planet doesn't stand a chance if they get this far. Don't worry. We'll do something. It just might take a while. Depending on um, multiple factors. Oh boy. I need to get the Alchemist's Stone again. 
I might actually pause the game and go do that, or pause the recording and go do that. Are you looking, are you seeking one of the weapons I've made? If so, you must visit the nearby store, but the finer weapons will cost you. We can recruit him for 60,000 fall, let's do it. I don't normally do this, but this alone is worthy of compensation. I'm not particular about my patrons as long as they value my weapons. That means everything to me. I guarantee unparalleled quality. Yeah, I'll give him the money. I may actually have to do some off-screen grinding soon. We have a deal. It may take some time, but I guarantee it will be worth the wait. Um, let's send him to Aquios for now. Yay! Now that we've come to this, I can say Dr. Lingod and his colleagues were justified in pursuing their research. But, please excuse me. I need some time to think. There are a few things I need to straighten out in my mind. I am not rushing you. Take your time. Do whatever needs to be done. Um, let's see... You know what, I guess I'll take you guys with me. We have to go all the way back to the Mosul Dunes. Which I'm not entirely sure I can remember how to get to at this point. Come on, sneak past him? Yes. Honestly, I, none of these things should bother me, but I'm sure that they will try. Let's see, Surferio will be up here, I think. Yeah, I had I had this item at one point. Only I had not lost my footage and had to redo this. Who are you? It's the retail rabbit. Ah, oh, he can charge my ring. No, my ring is fine. Oh, how disappointing. Yeah. Be gone, you vile beast. Uh, and where's the chef? Can I recruit you yet? <laughs> I want to cook some humans. <laughs> Forget it. And you know, we could also probably bump into Roger around here. But let's not. We don't want him to know that we're back in town. Our party is already full. There's no room for him. Oh, come on. Are you really going to trap me in here? God damn it. You know what? Kill these winches. I wasn't wanting to fight. Yeah. 340 damage. She's only doing like 100 some damage. Or whatever. Maybe she did 1,000. However much we're doing, it's not nearly enough. There we go. Get out of here, rocks. Soon. Ugh. Just run. If you guys might might think I'm bitching because I don't like combat in this game, and that's not true. I like combat. It's just that these fights are completely and totally pointless. The experience is not even close to enough to level me up. And uh, honestly, these fights are not fun. They're not a challenge at all. So let's see. If I was an alchemist's stone. Where would I be? The fights in the bonus dungeons and towards the end of the game get a lot more fun because they are more challenging. Hmm, I wonder if I can recruit this guy yet. Hello, you. Oh, wait, could I even recruit you? Balbados. I see you can't tell whether this is real or not. Well, it's fake. If it were real, it'd be worth an entire city. It's likely a practice piece made about 100 years ago, and it was made by Daxon the Seventh. Look, the name's right here. It takes at least 30 years of practice before you're capable of making such an appraisal. Wonderful. Cooking ingredients, too bad, it's a complete waste of time. I don't know what item Balbados wants. I may recruit him at some point in the future, too. Hello, you, Aquaberries. Another stinking waste of time. Waste of my time. Waste of everyone's time. 
Um, are these real chests or are they traps? Machinery materials. I don't think I've got very many of those. And what about you? Perfect berries, yay. That's perfect. That dragon... Kind of a pain. I think he can do an instant KO attack or a zombie attack or something like that. Alchemist's Stone. Again, I can pull up my strategy guide if I wanted. And just head right to it. But maybe this is a, this is a huge chest. Yep, there we go. Alchemist Stone. Wonderful. Now, let's get the hell out of here. Maybe grab another chest. I see one way out. I see a couple out here. So let's go grab this one, too. I don't know if there's anything else important out here. A fire pixie. Yeah. Might be worth adding to an item later. Hello, dragon breath. What about you? Synthesis materials. Yay! That was that was worth it. Those are still pretty rare. Smithery materials. Get out of here, you flippin' lizard. I don't have anything for you. I think I already ran down the other side, so... This place is tapped out. Next stop... Um, I'm trying to think here. We might actually go to the city of Aquios and see if I can recruit a few people from that town. I believe um, that one little that one little munch, munchkin, Michelle or Michel, however he wants his name pronounced, is there. Yes, 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 yes. It's like a magnet. As soon as the enemy sees us, zoom, they're on us. And I don't have a sprint button. <laughs> Yay! Give it up, you two. Unless you're gonna kill them in one hit, I don't want you wasting your strength. Also, this is gonna be the last video that I record today. I think. I might actually start recording some more Mother 3. I'm trying to think. I think I've recorded five episodes for this today. It's been an, it's been a good day today for advancing this series. Honestly, I'm ready to be done with it. Ready to free up another slot and, um, on my channel. I don't know if I'll be starting anything else soon. Kind of leaning towards no. Farewell, Sufario. I don't think I'll ever be going back to that town, either. Unless I go to recruit that chef, that is. No! Oh no, they're gonna kill us! If only this was like Earthbound. This game could have used so many mechanics from other games. Maybe they didn't use them out of honor or something like that. I don't know. Game mechanics, though, are not sacred. I just want to specify that right now. <sighs> Let's see. If they were, they're... Yeah, never mind. They're, they're just not. <laughs> If you're making a game, take whatever mechanics you want from whatever game you want, mix them into your game, and there you go. Your goal is to make a good game, that's it. I checked just to be sure, and it seems our people, supplies, and passwords are all the same. It seems this is without a doubt the paterni we all know. That's good. I'm kind of surprised that she thought to check that. That's good thinking, though. Still got the same asshole monsters that it's always had. Monsters with a death wish. Okay. 
I don't want to do any inventing here because the save point is not that close. We could go see the queen and go see how she's doing, too. Okay, this guy. Yes, what is it? I'm busy studying. My mission is to write books that help people. I don't have free time like grown-ups such as you. And he wants 85,000 full? Okay, hmm. Do you want me to write a book or something for you? That's gonna take almost all my money, wow. Um, yeah, I do. Wow. Any delivery date and any subject matter. So, it is quality you seek. I'll be glad to accept the job under such dreamlike conditions. Wonderful. Okay, you go there. The inventor Michelle has signed with us. Um, I'm gonna do just a little bit more running around. Was there more inventors around here? Oh, wait. There was one guy who kept blocking me in. Was it... here? It might have been back in Paterni. Hmm. Remember that? I think his name was Boyd, maybe? He tried to block me into the building a couple times so I couldn't even get out the door. I would like to recruit him. And yeah, after this, after I stop recording this video, I'm gonna have to go do a little bit of uh, off-screen grinding somewhere. I'll probably go back to the moon base, and uh, whenever you guys see me, I will be a much higher level and have much more money. But I'm not gonna record that, because it'll probably take me a few hours. And I don't feel like wasting the time saving that footage, so... If I was... If I was a jerk who liked to block people in, where would I be? Might not have even been this town. Okay, this... This was the... I think this was the Craftsman's Guild, right? Yeah, it was. Anything new going on, Welch? You can do everything necessary using your blah 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 blue. It'd be nice if you had something new to say. Are you here to become an inventor too? Yep. They don't even know what's going on in the outside world. They are completely detached from reality. Okay, maybe it was... up here? No, it's also possible that it was back in Arius. That it happened. I may do a little bit of recruiting for inventors off-screen, too. Mm. Okay, this is my... That's my shop right there, so what is this place? No. Nope. Yeah, actually, I think it was all the way back in Arius. Okay. I'll run there. I might as well. I'll take you guys with me, and then I'm probably going to end the video. This might be a short one. Um, Arius was this way, right? Who are you? Runologist on patrol? Oh, yeah. I'm excited about our inventing possibilities. I will not do any crafting off-screen. I'll force you guys to sit there and watch me fail over and over and over. And then, once I waste all my money, I'll force you to watch me reload. But don't worry, I'll label the video crafting, or something like that. So, if you see an hour-long video labeled crafting, just know what you're in for. And you've been warned. Okay, so... I don't think this is a private residence, maybe? Yeah. Hey, wait a second. Wait a second. I saw that. Just barely. More perfect berries. That'll be useful in the battles to come. Hey, Sophia. 
So this is the village where you and the others got mixed up in a war. That must have been awful, Plump. It was. This whole planet was awful. In fact, this whole planet could have been cut out of the plot, and basically nothing would have been missed. They could have condensed this 30-hour tromp here down into about 10 hours, and nothing would have been lost. Hey, it's th this is who I wanted. A poorly wielded sword is a sad sword. If you're a warrior of low standing, never blame your inexperience on your weapon. And amazingly enough, I can't actually recruit him yet. He must want an item that I don't have. Okay. I think I am going to save it here and end the video. And uh, whenever I come back, we will most likely, almost likely be in Paterni getting ready to do crafting. But I'm going to do a whole bunch of running around off-screen without you guys. So, here we go. Let's overwrite this. Yes, more crafting when we come back. I can hardly wait. And you will see the true power of crafting. Oh yes, it is going to be absolutely insane.